The Bahamas are unlike anywhere that I've freedived before. Pristine coral reefs with sunken shipwrecks hint at the colorful maritime history of this mysterious archipelago. But what makes it so incredible is that it is one of the few places in the world where sharks are allowed to thrive. Sharks play a really critical role no matter where they are. They really oversee the health and balance of all the ecosystems, which is incredibly important for all of us no matter where we live. If we lose sharks, the scary thing is we don't know what will happen. There are places in the world that we have seen the negative impact. Coral reefs in particular really do start to suffer. So that's why it's critical to start, you know, saving these animals, having these conversations, taking actions, and making more sustainable choices. Because all around the world, sharks are being hunted. Every year, over 150 million sharks are slaughtered by humans, and almost half are killed for their fins alone eaten as a status symbol in Asia. Despite the dangerous levels of mercury contained in shark meat, they are increasingly targeted for global consumption. And now, a quarter of all shark species are threatened by extinction. In 2011, the Bahamas took action, turning their exclusive economic zone into a shark sanctuary. And now, shark tourism generates more than 100 million US dollars every year. A single reef shark is worth more than $250,000 over its lifetime, compared to just $50 if the same animal is killed and sold at a fish market. One species in particular plays a vital role in the health of coral ecosystems. The great hammerhead shark. A thriving hammerhead population keeps stingray numbers low, which allows water filter species like mollusk to thrive and prevents sediment from clouding the ocean. No wonder the Bahamas have some of the clearest waters anywhere on Earth. 90% of hammerheads have now been wiped out, targeted for shark fin soup. When sharks are removed from the ocean, predator fish begin to overpopulate, reducing the number of smaller fish that eat the algae off the coral. The excessive algae will then destroy the reef and it would be disastrous for humanity. Reefs generate over $300 billion a year, acting as natural wave barriers against rising sea levels, a nursery for the world's fisheries, and a wealth of potential new medical drugs. Sharks have been keeping our oceans in balance for over 400 million years. They've survived all five of Earth's great extinction events. But now, they face their greatest threat, humans. Stop eating shark fin soup, stop eating shark meat, and support the creation of marine conservation areas and eco-shark tourism. Because our future depends on the survival of these magnificent, misunderstood creatures.